All right, guys, let's talk about the plumbing and drain systems in a garden suite. Now, the first thing is for the garden suite, you want to have a separate meter if possible. Okay, so for this property, we're able to get a separate meter for the garden suite. We actually have three meters in total. We have one for the main unit, one for the basement unit, and then one for the garden suite. And that's actually all located in the basement of the main house. Okay, so that water line, it's a three quarter inch line that goes downstream of the meter and goes underground and here it pops up into the service room in the garden suite. This is a three quarter inch line. So every new structure, you know, whether it's a standard home or a garden suite, you need to have at least three quarter inch for all of the new fixtures and faucets uh, for the unit, okay? Um, and then to the individual units, they're going to be a half inch line. Now, as I mentioned, I'm in the service room here. We're gonna actually have a tankless water he heater that's gonna be installed in the wall. And uh, this is actually going to do two things. It's going to provide the domestic hot water consumption for the unit. And it's actually also a boiler that's going to be heating rad pipes and radiators around the entire unit. And that's going to heat up the space. Okay, so this is going to be a gas boiler as well. Okay, so I'm going to move over to the kitchen here and uh, show you guys some of the uh, plumbing fixtures here. So. Right here in the middle of this window is where the kitchen sink's going to be. The actual lines are not shown here, but you can see there's a connection going into the bathroom. So if you uh, have a look in here, you can see that we have several half inch lines. So even though the main trunk that's coming in is three quarters of an inch, all of the individual fixtures and faucets are going to be supported by half inch, right? So you can see there's a uh, there's a box here for the laundry. There's a half inch for the hot water, half inch for the cold. Same with the, the vanity. We have a cold line for the, um, uh, for the toilet. And then we have a hot and cold for the uh, bathtub. All right. So half inch on all the individual fixtures and faucets. And then the next thing is uh, the drains. You can see these are all two inch pipes here uh, that goes into the drain. There's a main stack back there. And essentially all this goes into the slab and gradually goes out to the front of the house, okay? So at the front of the house, that's where we did a Y connection to the existing four inch drain, okay? So most cities and towns are going to require you to use the utilities of the main house, okay? Some cities will allow you to go directly to the, uh, the city main, okay? So you do a road cut and you connect there, but most cities want you to use the existing services of the main house. Some will allow you to go under the house and some will require you to do a Y connection in the front, okay? So that depends on the municipality, all right? So that's plumbing at a very high level. Um, hopefully that was useful and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching our video. We have a brand new garden suite guide, how to add one to your property. You can download a copy right now for free if you go to www.sweeteditions.com. We cover a ton of stuff you need to know if you want to start building these to create more housing and wealth at the same time. There's also a list of resources that we've identified that you can use. Download your copy now for free at www.sweeteditions.com.